This is Usain Bolt, fastest man on the planet with a top speed of 27.7 miles per hour. And this is me. Never ran track, often skips legs entirely, but I built a super speed suit to help me break his record with a Naruto run. It all started with my super jump shoes. Basically some cool jumping stilts that are made of springs attached to my legs. So it's like you're always on a trampoline. In theory, these jumping stilts should help me run faster because of the longer stride and the added leg spring. In reality, when I try to sprint, they weigh a ton and I end up eating shit. Humans are already very efficient at running, so any cyborg improvement like robot legs would be very hard and cost millions. We gotta go simpler. So this is my Iron Man style jetpack. Still needs some work, but it's got a special twist that I guarantee you've never seen before. So subscribe for that video, but during my early testing, I strapped electric jets to my hand like Iron Man and was jumping around to feel the thrust. And I couldn't help but think if this was the solution to my speed suit. By taking these massive jets that put out about 100 pounds of force and holding them backwards full on anime style, we should be able to sprint right past the haters and into the record books. So these are super light batteries and I attach them to my waist with a belt so they can flex with my movements. You look like Clark Kent. No I don't. <laughs> don't do that to me. <laughs> That looked crazy. <laughs> that was pushing me, dude. <laughs> Definitely look lighter. I, I don't know. If... Easier to run. Really? Definitely. That's big. Good news, they didn't slow us down. Calculated my regular speed at about 17 to 18 miles an hour. I'm fast as fuck, boy. Still fast as fuck, boy. Overlaying the clips, I went a smidge faster with the jets. The bad news, it's gonna be really hard to go any faster. Even though I have a ton of force pushing me forward, my legs still need to push upward to keep me off the ground. To do that, I need my foot planted firmly, so unfortunately, my legs still need to move very fast. It feels like almost like you're running downhill. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stop. Right, right, right. <laughs> So this is a giant wing, used for wing surfing, and I've seen people get some big air with it. But my goal isn't to fly with this, just to get enough upwards force where hopefully I can take longer strides and I can keep up with the running speed. Then why are you on the roof? Um. Yeah, all right, whatever, I thought about flying. Oh God, <laughs> What would you think? When you got a giant wing, if you weren't such a buzzkill, I could have come down a way cooler way. Could have been like Aang's glider, you know? We just get a little gas tank because it's inflatable, and then no. bang, instant wings, and we can just fly. They don't even have insurance, bro. They don't need to know that. I saw you take off a couple times. <laughs> this is stupid. <laughs> Feels like some shit I would think of when I was like five. You sure. We'll just get some jets, <laughs> and like a wing, and we'll jump off the roof. <laughs> I'm running out of room! <laughs> it looks pretty cool. Very anime, honestly. But is it actually helping? Kind of. I do feel lighter, but I also have zero control. I can't balance because I have jets on my hands. So the second I start to lift, I lose control and the wing could nosedive. Oh God, oh God. <laughs> so it's basically a giant parachute and I'm way slower than I was before. You gotta learn how to lose before you can learn how to win. Instead of that, I think we need my feet to slide. That way I can still push myself up, but can go faster than my legs can move. Now wheels do this, but that's kind of cheating and not running. But it's a good place to start and we might learn something. So I put some wheels on my shoes and gave it a shot. So I basically learned, this is terrifying. Heelys were never meant to go 20 plus miles an hour. One little rock and I'm done. Also, one jet wasn't working, so it was super awkward to even stand, much less try running. It was also 100 degrees out, and the wheels literally melted off. It is so hot out here. So much friction. Yeah, I know I got a radar gun, or just a gun gun. <laughs> then the jets exploded. It blew the fuck up. I don't know what happened, but when things explode, that's when we call it a day. So at this point, and really the entire video, I'm questioning if this is even possible. I don't know what my plan is. I don't exactly know my end goal. It just looks like I'm skating. 
badly. And we're not anywhere close to Bolt's record. We've actually gotten slower, but you can't be afraid of failure. So I kept pushing and rebuilt the jets. So now we've got six mini EDFs all in a circle around my arm. This really helps with stability because now the thrust is coming from all around my arm instead of one point. They're also twice as powerful now for better or for worse. It also gives me other crazy anime powers like big air jumps. <laughs> I don't take fall damage. Wind control. Like this is the best leaf blower on the market. It looks like you just walked out of a snowstorm. <laughs> Job well done. Same time next week. <laughs> Only downside, it takes forever to charge. About three hours for each of these batteries. And I have to do all of those. Luckily, Anchor makes way faster chargers and they're down to sponsor us. They'll also charge regular stuff like your phone and computer too with USB. And they're launching all of these different chargers on July 25th. Some up to 150 watts. That's more than four times as fast as this charger. Which means uh, I think we're all charged up. I can get back to anime stuff like this. It looks just like the anime energy blast. It's so cool. Anchor chargers are also smart. It detects your phone and computer's power needs to charge it the fastest and safest. It also monitors temperature so this doesn't happen. And now it's 53% smaller and so efficient, they've apparently saved enough energy to power Hawaii for a month. <laughs> that is a crazy statement. To so check out Anchor Chargers with the link below. But now we literally have to reinvent the wheel. Cause I still want traction to walk and run like normal, which just wasn't possible with wheels as we learned. But at high speeds, I need to slide a bit when my legs can't keep up. So these materials have very low friction coefficients. I tested graphite, graphene, ice, all right, that one's a little odd. How would I even like, anyway, dry ice and Teflon, which ended up working the best. So we put it on some shoes and tried it out. Chose the pillow aisle because, you know, so they're slippery, but not too slippery. So I can still walk around normal, but also power slide anime style. Hello. I feel like just kind of where you want it between traction and not traction. <laughs> Dude, Michael Jackson would love these. It's like Heelys, but in 3D. Wow, this is gonna take some practice. Oh, God. Ah. <laughs> well, that's not good. Port just came off. Yeah. Yeah, we have to duct tape that back on. It's so jury rig now. <laughs> What am I trying to do here? Just take steps? Yeah, just see how you feel. The power seems to be really there though. Yeah, this is half power. That's crazy. Finally, I'm starting to think this might just be possible. I think with practice, yeah. you can. Because I can sort of balance with these too. Right, right. That's the secret. Right. What I'm seeing is you're able to move your legs and go forward. That was it, bro. The new shoes work. I can half run, half slide, go faster than I ever could normally. And unlike wheels, they don't actually need a smooth, hard surface. Let's take this outside. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Again, gonna take practice. A little better. Oh yeah. That's cool. Let's go, dude. I do wonder what, what you're going. 30's tough, bro. Dude, I know. My calculations show I'm hitting about 19 miles per hour before I have to slam on the brakes so I don't crash on the fence. With that, we've officially beat my normal running speed. Now we just gotta beat Bolt. For that, we moved to a bigger field and also got a legit radar gun. Hit it. How fast do you think you were going? I don't know. I'll look now. Bro, <laughs> the point is we need to match them. You just gunned it at me. Just do like 15, yeah. Just, no, no, 15, not 60. All right, go. 13, 14, 15. All right, it's accurate. Last step, get fitted out. And when you thought it couldn't get better, I have a <laughs> Fortnite backpack. <laughs> First test, and it already broke. Literally, look what just happened. <laughs> oh my God. Jesus Christ. Yo, that's deep in there too. I know, it got sucked in there. It may have bent one of the blades. It's <sighs> a good way to start things off. <laughs> Luckily, we've got 11 more jets. I can just get rid of this jet and all the rest will work. All right. <laughs> oh my God, dude. <laughs> Oh my god. Not functioning. Dude, they just went off. 
Really? So I guess the controller freaked out when I unplugged one motor and sent all the rest to full power. I was in panic. So fix the code and try it again. So we're down to about 80% power, but let's see how fast we can go with more space. Yeah. Oh my God. Yeah. That was 21. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go, dude. Oh my God. Oh, Holland. Two engines down, too. That's... We're at 21. That was wild. You think that's fast enough to beat an Olympia? No. We need to go faster. <laughs> I got new Arduino controllers, wires, and insulation from Micro Center. New customers get $25 off any AMD and Intel processors purchased in stores. Also submit your builds to the Build Showcase and get a coupon for your next in-store purchase. Starting to feel a bit better, and after a few more bumps and scrapes, I was getting the hang of it. <laughs> Blades are eating tonight. <laughs> Damn, I'm just gonna tuck this into my pants. That's what I did last time. It's such a weird sensation. Slide running like Naruto with jets on your hands going 20 plus miles an hour. It felt cool though. I was getting faster and drawing some attention. Maybe a little too much. Dog's gonna kill me. Yeah. But we still haven't beaten Bolt, so I thought some competition could help push me. So this is Nick Simmons, Olympic runner. Simmons battling to get past Solomon. Major runner gets him the wins. Also makes a lot of great running YouTube videos, so definitely check him out. Uh, we're gonna race. Go easy or you want to be all as out? As fast as you can, man. We actually brought you something else that might help. Oh my These gosh. are the new, uh... <laughs> I just want to make sure it's a fair race. Oh no, uh, man, I'm gonna dunk on you right now. <laughs> <laughs> we'll go head to head. Easy. That didn't look so good, bro. I slipped, dude. I tore my, my arachnophobia. Cut you? that. Cut that. We're not using that. Let me get the jet. Ah. You're like, I'm, I'm nervous. I know. You really do. You're in his head. Trying to tire me out. Yeah, exactly. I want to just run. The way you have to do it. Right. Runner set. Go. I was like, hold on. <laughs> First defeat to a cyborg. Yeah. Explained yeah. to me over the yeah. phone. I was like, okay, like, there's no way this is gonna work, yeah. but it works. <laughs> I think we're finally ready to try for the record of Usain Bolt. So after months of development and training and testing, we went back to the field one more time. Then this happened. Oh, oh, oh. oh my God, dude, these fucking sprinklers. I know, dude. Literally right as we're about to go, sprinklers turn on. That timing couldn't have been worse. That couldn't have been worse. <laughs> you can't plan that either. Like, so we about, annoying. We were about to go. Yeah, water and high voltage jets don't mix too well, but we've come too far and we're not stopping now. Wow, that was sick. What are we at? 21, 22, 26. Oh. I think I got up to 26. Oh my God. <laughs> so close. Yeah. One more mile an hour, we break the record. Literally. <laughs> All right, baby, go. God. Oh my God, are you okay? Yeah, I'm good. Good Lord, you're cruising yeah, in there. I was pushing it at the end. God. I was like, I could stop or I could just go for it. <laughs> Felt faster. I don't know what you got. Yeah, we gotta to. see. It's a photo finish. And I busted the motor with that fall, so that was our last shot. I hope that was it. We gotta check, man. <laughs> Look. Give me the numbers, coach. Come on. I, I've seen 25 consistently then. Wait, what was that? Was that 29? Wait. Instant replay, challenge the play. Frame by frame. Yo! 29. <laughs> Look at that, bro. 25. Oh. 
29. Oh! 27 too. Oh my so god. That's also hits that, and then I skid. <laughs> Whoa, let's go. That's a speed record. I, I don't know what the logistics are with like legality of this, whatever. <laughs> what? But what? Usain Bolt, eat my. <laughs> <laughs> Probably shouldn't say that. No, but. no. <laughs> wow. That was fast. After just so much bullshit. Yeah, dude. I know. <laughs> so, explosion after explosion, Explosions. dude. That's yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Ha 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 ha!